Kula here. Hope you guys are having a great day. I am not feeling 100% today, so I decided to make some videos for you guys just to kind of cheer myself up and make myself feel better. Uh, I do have something kind of fun to show you guys. I have my very first bobble bar order, and this box is going to make my camera go nuts with the colors here because it is neon pink and like chartreuse. Um, I got a $10 gift card to Bobble Bar from a gift, like a Stila set I had purchased. I got a really good deal on it. It was like half off, so it was like $16. And so I checked out Bobble Bar. If you don't know what Bobble Bar is, um, it is like a jewelry store that's online. They basically just sell like fashion costume jewelry. So like really like nice big chunky pieces. Um, a lot of really cool stuff is on there. I was kind of browsing around. It is a little pricey. I tend to like to buy my jewelry from Forever 21 because I am super cheap like that. Um, so for like trendy things or things I'm going to wear like a season, I'd rather pay Forever 21 prices than buy something. But um, like I said, a lot of really cute stuff on there. They have a nice sale section, which is kind of where I browsed first. There were a couple things I wanted. Um, I held off kind of in the hope that there would be a sale, and there was a sale on the sale. There's an extra 20% off the sale. Unfortunately, a couple of the items I was looking at were sold out, but I ended up picking out something really cool. So it comes in this box here. It is neon pink, and this little envelope here is actually my invoice. I thought that was really cute. It came sealed and everything. Very nice, like almost like a hand, kind of handmade touch to it. I thought that was super duper cute. Um, I had really a really great experience with my first order with Bubble Bar. Um, I guess I'd never ordered from them before. I made an account. I placed my order. Everything was very prompt, very quick. Um, I feel like it is a very professional service, so that was really, really good. Um, uh, my jewelry came in this little black bag here. There's nothing in it now, but I thought that's cute. That's a nice way to store it. Um, the uh, gift card and then the brace that I had got in the Stila set also came in a similar black bag, but I think it said like bubble bar times steel on it, so that was really cool. And then my jewelry came in a Ziploc bag and it came in another bag in bubble wrap, so it arrived very safe and sound to me. Uh, I don't know too much about other people's experience with Bobble Bar. I know it is featured in a few subscription boxes and so I have heard of it before. Um, it is something I'm familiar with through so other people's subscription box videos, but I personally have never like watched like a full Bobble Bar, like this is what I got from Bobble Bar haul kind of thing. But I mean, I my stuff arrived perfect and nice and safe, so really happy with that. Uh, there was a little card in here too called the Bobble Bar, the Smart Girl's Guide to Bobble Care. Again, these colors are gonna make my camera go totally nuts because they are neon. And it just kind of talks about how to take care of your fashion jewelry. It is fashion jewelry, so it's not as robust as regular jewelry would be. Like my wedding ring can go through anything, but <laughs> that is kind of besides the point. Um, it says to keep away from moisture, so no water, lotion, or perfume. When not in use, jewelry should be neatly stored, which holds true for pretty much any jewelry. Uh, give bobbles a day off to limit wear and tear, and pack jewelry carefully for travel, and always carry on with your jewelry, which is also very good advice. So this is what I got. I ended up getting pale pink Aztec drop earrings. So again, with the hot pink, they came on this card here. They have this cute little tag. Uh, you have to have this tag on here in order to return the products. Shipping is free from Bobble Bar. So after the discount and after my gift card, I only paid $2 for these with free shipping. So that, you know, is better than Forever 21 prices. And these ended up being way prettier than they looked online. Like there's, I don't know how well this is gonna show up like just cause it's like this hot pink background, but there is a depth to these pink ones. Like there's like an opalescence to them and there's like mint stones around them. They are very pretty. They do feel very significant. Like they don't feel like cheap costume jewelry. They do feel like, like, I mean, they're fashion jewelry, but it's not, like, the cheap stuff. Like, this isn't Forever 21 stuff. This is, like, if you went to, like, a department store and bought costume jewelry, and this little one says Bobble Bar on the back of it, and I thought that was really, really cute. But, you, I mean, as you can see, like, these, these are well-made. Like, these aren't just something cheap. I don't know if I would have paid the full price for these. I believe they were, like, 30-something full price. But, I mean, for the $2 I spent, I definitely got my money's worth. And I think they're really, really pretty. They're not too big. Um, a lot of the pieces that were on sale, you can find my earring hole here, uh, were gigantic. Like, a lot of the necklaces were huge. Oh my gosh, can I not do this while I'm talking? I'm looking in my mirror. I'm going to make a really stupid face. Come on. Did I do it? Yes, all oh, good. Okay. is embarrassing. I swear to you, I put on earrings like every single day. So it is big, but I don't think it's too overwhelming. I mean, they also have pictures of them worn, which I think is really, really important for like a jewelry kind of sale thing, like a jewelry store, is to have pictures of the items worn if you can't see them in real life or something to see them to scale. Because you can look at a picture and be like, oh, that's really cute. And then when you click on the image to see it like on a person, you're like, 
oh my god, that's gigantic. So I'm really glad that they do have those pictures so you can kind of see how they look. I'm gonna try with this other one on just so I don't feel so uneven. They are a little bit heavy, but I mean that again just kind of shows that there is some heft to them. They aren't just like super duper cheap and I don't feel like these are gonna break on me anytime soon. Like I feel comfortable wearing these out. Like I'm not worried about them. Oh my god. <laughs> this is really hard, surprisingly. Ow, okay. So yeah, mine is this cute tag here, which is there for obvious reasons, so you don't just wear these and return them. I think these are really, really pretty. And I'm really, really excited to get them, especially for the $2 I paid. So definitely, I am impressed and very pleased with my first purchase from Bobble Bar. And come more sales, I'm definitely going to check them out every now and then, because I think, you know, if you're looking for some nice, inexpensive costume jewelry, I think it's a good place to check out. So yeah, that is kind of my first impressions like first order from bubblebar.com it was a very positive experience very very happy with what i got i'm very happy with the quality of the items i purchased and i didn't have to cust i didn't have to contact customer service for anything but from the way things look i assume it'd be pretty great so yeah thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video I hope you have a great rest of your day